All right, Council, we resume proceeding. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, Honorable Commissioners. I recall the witness, Mr. Tony Gattis. We remind you of your oath. You can have a seat. Mr. Gattis, I'll hand over to you this exhibit so you can have them on the side. We we'll just collect them, make sure everything is returned when you finish. Can you hand over these exhibits to Mr. Gattis? They are exhibit MS11. Um, to MS38. I'll be referring to them, so they are all numbered. So when I refer to them, you look for the appropriate exhibit. Okay. Just put them. Mr. Gattas? Yes. I'll be referring to them. So when I ask you to look for one, you look at the number and okay. we you understand? Yes. Okay, very good. Now, Mr. Gattas. You have provided the list, the, bills, the numbers of the bills of lading and the containers that were shipped out of the country, both, as you said, of HMS, HMC left by um, Gamico yes. and HMC that was uh, mined by APAM. Uh, can you tell us the total tonnage mined by Gamico and APAM? Respectively, the total tonnage. tonnage. Um, your, your document does not give us the total tonnage. Are you able to tell us the total tonnage? Do you understand the uh, question? Yes, I understood, but, uh, but I need the... Um, can you, you can look at MS-36. You know, MS-36 and MS-36D, uh, MS there are two MS-36. They are D and E, which have um, the list and the bill of lading attached. If it's something you can tell us by looking at those documents, say so. If you cannot, by looking at those documents, also say so. So we don't waste time. <laughs> The tonnage is uh, mentioned on the invoices. The five invoices, each invoice has its own tonnage. The tonnage is mentioned in the invoices. invoices. Yes. Yes. The, you have eight invoices, five for Gamico and five three for... Five for Gamico and three, and three for, for... Yes. Yes. Now, what is the total tonnage? For Gamico. That was my question. You will need time to add it up. Okay, let's let's we will leave that question and come yes. back to it. Um, what I would like you to confirm, as you did yesterday, you said um, um, if you look at Exhibit MS36, you said the first three invoices were paid to Guarantee Trust Bank. And the second two invoices um, were the ones that were offset. Offset. That's that's what you said. Yes. 
two uh, plus sum of the three eight three. Sum of the three. Three eight three BL number uh, DMB zero one zero two three eight three. The first two, twenty second December twenty sixteen. You know you first gave January us January twenty seventeen. You know, there are two BLs here from uh, now. MS36D plus uh, DMB0102383 also was deducted some money from this invoice. Okay. Yes. Now, wh where was the... We know the three invoices which you said were paid, were paid into Guarantee Trust Bank. Yes. That is the APAM account in Guarantee Trust Bank. Yes. The dollar account. Yes. And um, yesterday you said that was 322,000 US dollars. 585. All right. Thank you. Okay. Now the one for 22nd December 2016, where was it paid? BL number uh, DMB0102297. The two that were paid. Let's say the two that were paid. You said... Yes, the balance the of one this. The one dated 1st January 2017, you said was set off, leaving two. Where were the two paid? It was not uh, uh, all set up. It was uh, some of the money to complete the $290,000 offset it from this 383. And the balance of $142,000 was paid in Shanghai Gambia uh, Sky Bank. Shanghai Gambia at Sky Bank. Sky Bank, yes. Okay. So can you tell us the balance that was the amount that was taken off that invoice and, and uh, offset? That's well, a simple uh, calculation. Simple calculation from three of them, it was around $290,000. I'm going to show you this bank statement, <coughs> and I would like you to confirm that it's your it's Shanghai Gambia Industries Company Limited bank statement with um, Sky Bank. Can you collect this document and give it to the witness, please? Both dollars, both dollars and dollars. It's not yet admitted, my Lord, um, Mr. Chairman. Yes. This is the Shanghai Gambia Industries yes. Company Limited Bank statement with Sky Bank. Yes. Mr. Chairman, I'm applying to have the statement admitted. And can you confirm that it's both dollars and dollars, U.S. dollars? The first two pages. Yes. And one page uh, dollar, yeah. yes. Sorry, it was off. The first two pages, uh, the first three pages are dollars, the, the last page is dollars, and the rest of, are your account opening information containing your ID, identification documents, your tax, and so on. Yes. All right, thank you.
Mr. Chairman, I'm applying to have the document admitted. Can you show the document to Mr. Tambedu, please? You have not shown. Sky Bank, bank statement for Shanghai Gambia Industrials Company Limited for the period 19th August 2016 to 19th May 2017 and related documents admitted Mark MS 76. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Can the witness have MS 76 once it's marked? 76. Uh, Mr. Gattis, meanwhile, can you look at exhibit MS 36E and MS 36E? <coughs> These are the three invoices that were that represent the HMC mined by APAM. Yes. Now, in MS-76, which is the U.S. dollar bank, bank statement of Shanghai Gambia Industrials Company Limited, you have two inflows, 16 February 20, 
2017 of 81,000 US dollars from Hainan Funjang Mining Company Limited. That is in respect of which of the invoices. Can you confirm for me, please? Eighty-one. Can you can you give him the statement? Can you give him MS seventy-six? Give him MS seventy-six. The U.S. dollar statement inflow 16 February 2017. Yes, this is the APAM 06. It's it's in other it's for which invoice? Is it 2297? 2297. Yes. PL number 2297. For the sum of 81,052. Yes. All right. There's a second inflow, 31st March 2017, for 61,111 dollars. Yes, this is uh, the balance from BL2383 and 2455 is the balance from which which in which which bl 2383 383 yes and 2455 the 2455 yes um let's look at the invoice for 2383 yes the invoice is how much? 45,573 dollars. 45,573 dollars. Yes. And the last invoice, which is um, 17 January 2017, is 55,228. Yes. Now, you told us a while ago that. Um, 2383, part of 2383 was used, was offset. Yes. That's what you said. Yes, exactly. If 2383 is 45,573, yes. how can part of that have been used to offset the 290,000? All of it was used according to what you're telling us now. Sorry? You are telling us now yes. that 61,000 US dollars covers the whole of 383. The $290,000. The $61,000 that was paid into Shanghai account on the 31st March 2017. No, it's uh, BL2297 is the $61,000. No. You said 2297 is the $81,000. That's the first invoice. Yes. $81,000. Yes. yes. The second inflow of $61,000, you said, was for 383 and part of 455. It's uh, uh, 2455. A, and a part of 383. It's 455. Five. Now, it, it's the other way around. It's not the way around. It, it's like this. Hmm. I already said before that we completed the $290,000 from the 383. Yes. Previously. That's what you said. That's what happened. That's what we did. All right. Yes. Um. Can you confirm, Mr. Gattis, that um, apart from these containers, these invoices, no other HMC was shipped by APAM to China? I can confirm. You can confirm that? 100%. Right. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, Gatsin also has 
statement of account, uh, a bank account with um, Sky Bank. Is that yes. correct? Yes. Okay. You also have. Um, You also have bank um, a bank account with Guaranteed Trust Bank. Yes. That's in. Yes. Okay. I'm going to show you two bank statements, dollar C and uh, US dollars for Gatsin Company Limited, Guaranteed Trust Bank. Can you confirm these bank accounts, please? Yes. These are guts and bank statements with guaranteed trust bank. <laughs> Mr. This Chairman, I'm applying to have them admitted. Please show Mr. Tambido. Okay, once the witness confirms them, it's fine. Okay. I've seen them before.
I don't think it likes that. There we are. Mm -hmm. Very well. It's a guaranteed trust bank. Bank statement for Gutsin Company Limited. Account number 2021518. The period 11th September 2006 to 29th September 2017 and account number 202 for the period 3rd February 2012 to 29th June 2017.
2013 and account number 202151456131380 for the period 6 April 2009 to 30th June 2010 in a bundle admitted Mark MS 77A. Thank you. Guaranteed trust. No, not finished yet. Guaranteed trust bank shipment ledger in U.S. dollars. Account number two zero zero one five one four five six two four zero zero two zero for the period twenty first june two thousand and seven to twenty third december two thousand and sixteen Admitted Mark MS seventy seven B. Then guaranteed trust bank bank statement account number two zero two one five one four five six two seven seven zero eight zero for Gatson Company Limited for the period 11th September 2006 to 30th July 2007. Admitted Mark MS 77C. Yeah, that will be all. MS 77C. Are you sure? MS 77C is the dollar account. <coughs> Mr. Mr. Chairman, the dollar account for the Guaranteed Trust Bank, is it MS 77C? Or both? All right, thank you. No, no, we correct. Uh, as a matter of correction, please. Take note, Secretary. The MS 77B, the shipment ledger, US dollar account number is 202 instead of 200. All the numbers are correct. Yes, Council. May we hear you, Council? Yes, I, I was just trying to make a distinction between the, the numbers. The, the shipment ledger is MS77B. That's US dollars. B. Sorry. That's what I wanted to confirm. And the Dallasy? Shipment ledger. GT Bank, Guaranteed Trust Bank, Dallasy account for Gatsin. Yes. yes. It's MS77. MS77B, yes. That's the shipment ledger. Okay. US dollars at Guaranteed Trust Bank. All right. Thank you. Um, so, Mr. Gatsin, you'll get the documents back one day, ma. Mr. Gattas, yes, get, Gatsin, get. Um, so, the amount of money that was not transferred from the the HMC that was exported, you're saying it's about $290,000, and you used it in China? As a deposit, yes. That's what you said, as a deposit against some machinery? Dredgers. 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 These are, these are not machinery. What are they? 
these are dredgers to uh, dredge in the sea in the uh, pond okay, okay. you don't in, consider in the them river. as machinery yes okay all right all right um thank you now mr gutters you all, mr gutters you also have an account for gutsin company limited skybank yes both dollars and dollars yes Hainan transferred into your dollar account a significant sum of money. Yes. 299,981 dollars. 300,000 dollars. And this is 8 September 2016. Yes. Now, Hainan is the company to which all HMC is exported. Is a partner with the Shanghai John Miller. All HMC is exported. Yes. Is that correct? Yes. Um, you did not. You said you have submitted to this commission all the invoices with regard to HMC. Yes. And these were paid to Guarantee Trust Bank. Yes. The Apam account. Yes. As well as the Shanghai account with Sky Bank. Yes. Yet we find Hainan paying 299,000 US dollars, approximately the amount missing from EPAM into your bank account in Gutsin Company Limited at Sky Bank. This is a different business. doesn't oh. have anything with uh, the uh, HMC exported from Gambia. Sorry, say that again. It's a different business. What is yes. this business? This is, as I said yesterday, this is a link between Shanghai Zun and uh, Shanghai Gambia and Shanghai Gambia and uh, Hainan Fugan, different business with Gatson in is China. The, what is the business? We want to hear from you. What is the I business? I said yesterday that this is sales of minerals between countries. Shanghai Gambia. Is selling mineral where? No, I mean in China when we do business. Yeah, explain to the yes, commission. I'm we want to know the nature of the I'm explaining that this yes. is business between Shanghai Zon Minerals and Hainan Fugan, and I am the one who is uh, arranging uh, sales of minerals from different countries. I have some profit over there. When well, I need it, to be paid somewhere, I ask them to transfer it to me either here or in uh, China or wherever I need it. I ask them to do it. And you have agree, you have your agreements, of course. I'm sure we have. You have agreements. agreements. We have everything. What we would like to see is your export documents showing that you have exported any that Shanghai any any minerals anywhere from anywhere. No Shanghai problem. Gambia Limited. Not Shanghai Gambia Limited, I said Shanghai Don Minerals. Or is it Gutsin Company Limited? It's Shanghai Don Minerals. From Gambia is only APAM did the export. Who has this business in China? Is it Shanghai Gambia Limited or Gutsin? Tony Gattas as Gutsin. And I'm a partner in Shanghai Gambia, sister of Shanghai Zone Minerals. And you have documents to show that you are a partner in any com company in there China? There are contracts, yes, I can show. Yeah, we would like to see no documents problem. from the Chinese authority, not from Hainan, not from Shanghai, but from Chinese authority showing that you have um, shares in China, in a Chinese company. It's not shares, it's contracts. It's for what? The, for the business. We mm. do contracts of sales. Um, I'm going to show you the bank accounts of Gutsin Company Limited that I mentioned, and please confirm that these are your bank accounts, Gutsin Company Limited in Sky Bank, dollars and dollars. Okay. <coughs> Verify. Uh, excuse me, before you continue. Before you continue. Uh, you've used the words Shanghai Zone Government. 
it's not clear to us. Did what did you actually say? Shanghai Johnson Minerals. Jong? Yes. Jong Jong Minerals. Jong Tong. No, no, the 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 Shanghai Zong John Minerals. Yeah, can you spell that please because Or is it written somewhere? It's written here in the comment. Yeah, can we look at it? It, it sounded as if it was talking about government. <laughs> I didn't uh, hear him properly. Yeah, well, let's get the. Uh, She can do it better. <laughs> I don't see it here. It's in the contract of. Uh, it's in the contract. Which which contract? Egg number. Cooperation. Uh, MS. Uh, you have the documents there. Which contract are you referring to? Which contract are you referring to? It's a cooperative uh, doc, uh, contract. Hmm? You mean the Memorandum and Articles of Association? No. The contract between APAM and uh, Shanghai. Uh, MS-14? Can you check MS-14? Is that, is that the one you mean? I don't have it. We have it. Look among the documents I give you. Yes. It's uh, Shanghai. Give us the number. They are all numbered, all the documents. MS-14. MS-14. Yes. Uh, we have the document. The Zhongzhen is the Z. We have Z the document, please. Yeah. 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 MS14. What does it say? Shanghai Zhong Z. H. O N. Z. H. O. N. G. H E N G. H E N G. Minerals Company Limited. Minerals Co. Limited. Okay. You've got it now. Yes, it's clear now. It is Shanghai Zhongheng Minerals Company Limited. Zhongcheng. Zhongcheng. Huh? Zhongcheng. Zhongcheng, yes. Stop at the end. We take the pause. Zhongcheng. 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 Very well. Yes, exactly. Yes. That's the pronunciation. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Very well, Council, you may continue. Sorry, what is the number? MS-14. No, the... Didn't you apply to admit? Okay. Hmm. Are you holding the bank statements? You were looking at the bank statements for Gutsin Company Limited? You didn't from give Sky it to Bank? 
You didn't give me the bank statement. I have I only you. the Shanghai one. No, I gave you the guts in the guts in um, bank no. statement. No. Sky Bank. That's what I showed you immediately. Oh yes, yes, yes. Yes. Both the Dallas and dollar account. Those are guts in statements. Mr. Chairman, I'm applying to have them admitted. Dallas and dollars. Sky Bank Bank Statement for Gutson Company Limited. Dallas account number 
for the period 1st August 2016 to 17th August 2017 and dollar account number 101252008 for the period 1st August 2016 to 17th August 2017 in a bundle admitted Mark MS 78. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Yeah. Um, Mr. Gattas, you said you had business with Shanghai in, in which countries again? In which countries? Vietnam, Mozambique, and Indonesia. Okay. Um, have you been to Vietnam? Never. Have you been to Mozambique? No. Have you been to Indonesia? No. Okay. I have not. In um, Mozambique, yeah. what do you do? What, do? what does Shanghai do in Mozambique? Buying uh, HMC. And what is your role in this buying of HMC? You said to buy what HMC? Well, I'm... What is, uh, we just want to understand the nature yes, of the I'm business. What is the nature of the business you have with Shanghai and Mozambique? I'm helping in the business. You're helping in the business? Yes. Okay. In Vietnam? I have contacts where I can get either better price or things like this. is, is, is commerce. You have contracts with people in Mozambique where you can get better price for Shanghai? Yes, and in Vietnam and in Indonesia. Sometimes also in Australia they have good... Uh, no, let's, let's uh, focus on the countries yes, where the, you said no, you I have. Mean, we need to, we want to understand the nature of the business for which you are earning $300,000. Yes. Um, you earned $300,000 in September 2016. Yes, and yes. Uh, sometimes it's more than that. So, sorry, sorry, before we continue, to avoid uh, confusion, you have just mentioned HMC. We've heard the word before. Can you please tell us what it means? It's heavy mineral he Heavy mineral concentrates. concentrate. Heavy mineral concentrate. Con yes, heavy minerals concentrate. Yes. And those concentrates consist of which minerals, please? Uh, titanium, zircon, and rutile. Thank you. You're welcome. And spe specifically in Mozambique, you, it's, you said it's HMC. You have contracts for HMC. Yes. Yes. Explain how do you earn money and who pays you? Sorry? How do you earn money? How did let's let's keep it to September? How did you earn money, and, and who? This who? is not only September. This is before in two thousand since two thousand and nine, two thousand and ten. We are doing this business. It's not uh, just September. It's years. And it's who built pays? Up in years, this business. And who pays you? Excuse me. Who paid you in in? Um, in the China. Business, in the business in, in China. I, 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 in the business in Mozambique, who paid you? Well, they pay uh, Shanghai Zonzen Minerals, different brokers. They paid you? They paid Shanghai Zonzen Minerals. And in um, which country did you say again, apart from Mozambique? Vietnam and Indonesia. Who pays you in Vietnam? I said, this is a business, is a broker. Is, is, Please is, answer my yes. question. Who pays it's you in Vietnam? Different companies. Different. I, uh, we just want to know one of them. Well, you have uh, Heinen Minerals, you have uh, uh, Fugan, you have many companies. They all pay you? They pay Shanghai, Zonzen Minerals, and I have 
Percentage there. Okay. What is the percentage? It depends on the minerals uh, concentrate uh, uh, quality. Between you sometimes five or ten dollars per ton. And the two hundred and ninety-nine thousand dollars represented exactly what percentages that you earn from these countries? Well, this is money uh, accumulated for the years, and I have some business there. And when I need money anywhere, I ask them to transfer it for me. And Shanghai pays you? Yes. But the money I'm referring to paid into your dollar account was paid by Hainan Funjang Mining Company Limited. Exactly. 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 Yes. That is not it's, Shanghai. It's, it's Hainan not, is not Shanghai. They are partners. Partners in what? In the business. In, in the in mineral how? business. How? They buy and they sell like we used to buy and sell. And there is an agreement between yourself and Hainan? Yes, of course. To be between yourself, Tony Gattas and Hainan? Between me, Shanghai, Zunzan Minerals, and uh, Fugan, and Hainan, and all these companies where we work, I have contracts with them for my percentage. As, um, as may please, Mr. Chairman, um, I'm sorry to interrupt. Um, Mr. Chairman, there must be some finality in answers that the witness given. This witness has consistently stated that he, is, uh, he does business with Shanghai Zhongzheng Minerals in China. So all business dealings, payments, are received by Shanghai Zhongzheng Minerals. But the witness is repeatedly asked the question, how much did you earn? Who paid you? But he keeps saying it is not him, it is Shanghai Zhongzheng Minerals in China. It's, it, it has, it's, the question is asked so many times so that the answer may change. As you please, Mr. Chairman. What do you say, Council? Um, Mr. Chairman, there might be a finality to um, answers given in cross-examination, provided that the answer is um, given in a consistent manner to a direct question. But I find that this witness is not answering the questions that I asked him. He says it's Shanghai that pays, but it's Hainun I'm interested in who paid into the account in the Gambia. He hasn't told us that what agreement he has with Hainan. Yes, this is, I, as I... We are uh, not sorry, talking okay. to you. Sorry. I am not badgering the witness, if that is what my learned friend is alluding to. This witness is not answering questions. He has not produced any documents. So he has not produced any contracts. And he's referring to various companies in China. So I am entitled to ask him as many questions as I, th as I think will elicit the, at least will lead us to finding out what is the truth of the situation between him and these Chinese companies, if there is one. Or whether it is money belonging to APAM that really is in his account. Mr. Chairman, that's sure. speculation, really. I mean, this witness has not gone that far. You, the point I'm, I'm trying to, to make is this witness does not have prior notice or foreknowledge of issues that are going to arise. Like, counsel is saying the witness has not produced documents. Did he know he was going to be asked to produce contracts between Shanghai Zhongzheng and the mining companies in Mozambique, Indonesia, Vietnam? He does not know that. He's asked now. So how could he have anticipated production of those documents? I am saying he has consistently stated it is he has business interest in Shanghai Zhengzheng Minerals. Shanghai Zhengzheng Minerals does business and he gets paid from profits. Shanghai Zhengzheng Minerals is a partner to Henan. So whenever he needs money accumulated from his own profits, it is sent. This is the evidence. But to ask the same question so that the answer will change, I mean, I don't want to use the word badgering, but that's what it will seem to me like. Until the witness changes his answer, the question keeps coming. With respect, I, I believe my learned friend is trying to make the story for the witness consistent. The witness's story has been less than inconsistent. Yeah, I take exception to that. No, I do not make any story. Hold it, witness. hold it. This witness has been very, very consistent. Hold it, Be, Ms. Ms. And let me, uh, mm -hmm. Hold it, please. Mm -hmm. Could you please 
um, tell us the question which has been answered but is consistently being asked. What is that question that you object to? Yes. Can you, the questions that are going to the... Oh, there are several questions. Yes. Yeah, can well, we have them? Yes. Well, I, I'm not... It's alluding to the fact that the witness, as Tony Gattas or Gatsin, is receiving money from Henan. From? Henan. The, 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 the Chinese company that sent the $300,000 in September. Hainan Company. Is it? Yes, my so, yes, Sorry. Mr. Chairman. Sorry, let's take the que questions. Question number one, yes. I'm listening to question the question. It's the series of questions alluding to the fact that he received those payments directly. Sorry, sorry I'm, I want to get to that. I'm sorry, my lord. A series, you are objecting to a series of questions alluding to the fact that Mr. Gattas. Mr. Gattas, yes. Yes, received. Received. Monies directly. Monies directly. From businesses. From businesses. In China, conducted by Shanghai. Businesses in, 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 in Businesses in China. China, yes, conducted. By Shanghai Zhengzheng Minerals. Conducted by Shanghai. When he has stated repeatedly... Hold on. I'm writing. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shanghai... I don't want to lose the trend of my thought, my question. Oh, the, the one that has just been clarified. Song Jing. Minerals. When he has consistently stated... Minerals Limited, yes. When... He has... The witness, I mean. Yes, has consistently stated stated that the businesses in China are done by Shanghai Zhengzheng Minerals. That the businesses in China are done by Shanghai. Yes, Mr. Chairman. Zhong Jing. Sorry. Is that the objection? Yes, Mr. Chairman. I'm saying there must be a finality to answers given by the witness. I mean, I'm sure maybe the commission does not operate um, by the rules of evidence, but I'm sure Mr. Chairman would take into account the, the raison d'etre for those rules. and to call in their aid if necessary. All right. What I'll do is I will pose a question and council will take it off from there. All right. Mr. Gatson. Sorry, Mr. Gatas. Sorry. Yes, Gattas. <laughs> Did you receive monies directly from businesses in China? Yes. And from which businesses did you receive these uh, monies? It's from the sales of minerals. From the sales of minerals? Yes. And who sold those minerals? Shanghai Junzhen Minerals. And what is your interest in the sale of those minerals? Well, this is uh, like uh, if we if we find better price in different broker uh, brokers. Uh, if who if who finds? 
me or uh, other partners uh, find good prices, we can negotiate and find a buyer and sell through Shanghai Zonzan Minerals and get our percentage. Yeah, that's what I want you to clarify. Yes. Th this is, that's and talk, talk for yourself, please. Yes, that's because what I'm others, saying. Because others are not being asked questions. So I would prefer you to use the word I. If you, you meaning you, Mr. Uh, Gattas. Yes, as me or... Uh, or your company. My company, we will uh, negotiate prices. We find better prices. I have lots of contacts and whenever, wherever we find the uh, minerals uh, in good price, the quality is good, the uh, percentage is higher in zircon or in rutile. This is uh, business. And when we offer it, we say that this is the price, we get our percentage on that. It's like a sort of broker. Some sort of? Broke. You mean you were acting as a middleman? Yes. A middleman? Yes. And then you make your profit? I make my profit. I see. And when you make your profit, you send uh, the money in, uh, to Zongai, Zhongjing Minerals account. Exactly, and I keep the money there. Whenever I need it... No, 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 I'm asking the money. Yes. Where did it go, your Is profit? That in, uh, Sorry? in Shanghai Zhongjing Minerals account. Do you have a shareholding in that account? No. In that company? No. You can take it off from there, counter. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thank, thank you, Mr. Chairman. Um, Mr. Gatters. There, I have not seen, but you can show us if you have, any payment received from Shanghai Zonzing, China, to any of your accounts here in Gambia. Can you show us any payment that you have received from Shanghai? I, d I don't. Uh, on which account? I don't. I don't uh, understand. On any account, have you received payment from Shanghai with regard to this brokerage business you have just explained? This money. The three hundred thousand dollar received by Hainan is instructed by Shanghai Johnson Minerals to 